In this video, I'll be showing you how to overclock your RAM in the easiest way. So let's get right into the video. Hello everyone, I'm Sunny and you're watching Juicy Tech. The first step of overclocking RAM is to check the rated speed of your RAM. You can check this by looking at the stickers on the memory modules or by checking its bug. This is the highest speed that the manufacturers recommend you to overclock. But you can overclock your memory modules more or less than that speed according to your needs. The first thing you need to know before overclocking your memory modules is to check the speed they are running at. And to do so, you can simply open the task manager by right clicking on the taskbar. Then in the task manager, you need to go to the performance tab. Here you can clearly see the speed of the memory modules. By default, all the DDR4 memory modules run at a frequency of 2133 MHz. Now we are going to overclock the memory modules on an ASUS ROG Z370E motherboard. So, at first open the BIOS menu by simply restarting the PC and by pressing the F2 or delete button while starting. In the BIOS menu, you need to select the advanced mode. You can also press the F7 for selecting it. Here you can find a tab named AI Tweaker. In this tab you can see that there are three options for AI overclock tuner, Auto, Manual and XMP. The Auto mode actually means non-overclock state. In the manual mode, you can choose your desired RAM speed from the option DRAM frequency. While choosing the RAM speeds, you need to keep in mind that you can even fry your RAM for making simple mistakes. So I'll recommend you to overclock your memory modules to a speed considering your PC's overall cooling system, power supply and RAM's heatsink quality. You can see that my memory modules are rated at 2666 MHz. So I'm going to overclock my RAM at that speed. And for the XMP or Extreme Memory Profiles, you just simply need to enable it and that's all. XMP will automatically overclock your memory modules to the suitable highest possible setting. So after doing all this, you need to exit the BIOS menu by saving all the settings. After your PC gets a restart, you can check the speed in the same way from the task manager. And you can now see that my memory modules are clocked at 2666 MHz. That means my overclocking was successful. If you face any problem while running the PC, then you can simply lower the speed in the manual mode like I have showed you before. You can check the RAM overclocking guide link given in the description below where you can get more information about RAM overclocking and step-by-step -step instructions for different motherboards like Gigabyte and MSI. Hope you enjoyed this video and be sure to like and subscribe for more contents like this. Stay tuned. Peace.